There was no calm before the storm in Springfield. Around 7 Wednesday night, the planter mill at the Durgan and Crow Lumber Company was engulfed. Once we started to establish a water supply and get things going, we realized we needed to go to a third alarm because of the volume of fire. In all, more than 75 firefighters from 20 towns responded to the call. No injuries were reported. The company's president says the structure measures 750 by 300 feet or longer than two football fields. Its sheer size made saving the surrounding offices a top priority. As it went along with the, the design of the building, we were unable to keep for any firefighters or anybody in the building. So it was all an exterior attack. The morning after, the building was still smoldering as investigators and the company's owners got a closer look. The mangled metal shielding some flames from the snowfall. Investigators say they may have pinpointed the site of the building where it began. However, we were unable to determine the cause of, as of yet. And due to the damage, we not, may not ever know exactly what the cause of it was. Owners say it's too early to determine how they'll move forward with half of their operations down. They told WMUR they anticipate it could be one year before everything is restored. Ownership says they will attempt to find other duties for the roughly 20 people who worked in the structure.